hey y'all what's up it's Teresa. thanks for joining me again on my channel for another video in today's video i'm going to be sharing some meals that i made by using the things that we already had in the house first thing i'm going to show you guys i have this chicken that i'm just putting in the crock pot and i'm going to season this up with some lemon pepper some paprika and i'm also going to add some onion And then I'm taking some aluminum foil, I'm gonna pop some butter on top of the aluminum foil. I'm gonna season that butter up because we're actually going to add on some frozen corn on the cob. I'm just gonna put the corn directly on top of the butter. This gives it a really nice flavor while it's cooking. I'm gonna wrap it up, pop it into the oven. So now the chicken is about halfway done. I'm going to take a piece of aluminum foil and that I've punched some holes into. This is my lazy girl method of getting some veggies to steam at the same time. I'm just going to take these vegetables and put them on top of the foil, season it with salt and pepper, go ahead and put the lid back on my crock pot and let this steam. Here is everything all cooked up. I have the chicken with the vegetables that are nice and tender. And then I have the corn on the cob that was cooked in the oven. Next thing I'm going to show you guys are these wraps. I made these using things that we already had in the house that I just really wanted to use up. And I also made some rice to go on these. First thing I have is some steak that we had in the freezer. And I'm just going to slice this steak into bite-sized pieces. I'm taking a little bit of butter with some garlic and the pan is on low. I wanted to leave this on low and let it melt because I don't want the garlic to burn. Now to the garlic and butter mixture, I'm just going to pop in all of the steak, give it a nice little seasoning and then I'm going to add in the peppers and onions. Go ahead and let all that cook up together. Once the steak and the peppers and onions are all cooked, I'm going to add in some shrimp. Then I just popped everything on a wrap. It's not the most appeasing looking dish, but it was delicious. And then on top, I just put a few drops of hot sauce. The last thing I'm gonna share with you guys is my version of junkyard fries. I'm taking a pan of french fries and I'm making sure that it's in a thin layer. Then I'm just gonna pop it directly into the oven. While I'm waiting for the fries to cook, I'm gonna go ahead and prepare my meat. I'm using ground turkey here that I've seasoned up. I'm gonna add in the rest of the peppers and onions that we have left in the house, and I'm just gonna let that cook down. Then again, I'm gonna add in my shrimp, season that. So once everything is done cooking in the same pot, I'm just going to throw it all onto the fries with some cheese, some jalapeno peppers, red pepper flakes, ranch dressing, anything that I can think of that I might want to put on these things. I put them on there and they are delicious. Thank y'all so much for watching. Thank you for subscribing. If you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you would subscribe, I will see you in the next video. Bye y'all.